so my people how are you guys doing hope you guys are doing good hope you guys are fine me i'm doing good like you already know most of you know me but i always need to present myself for the new people because you know the new people they don't know me and i hope at the end of this video they will get one or two interesting things and don't forget to share at the end so we keep the page moving we can help one or two people what was baffling me today was our people. Most of the time in life, when a lady succeeds, they will say that she is a, a runs lady. You know what I'm talking about. I won't use certain words because we're on Facebook. That she does runs with men. They don't see the days that she was putting on hard work to put on one or two things. Yeah, they will just see the fact that they see the success and on the side of the man when a man succeeds they will say he did something mysterious to have his money they won't see the days of hardship hard work how the energy he was putting in life things like that they don't see that but the question i'm always asking myself that is always making me laugh all the time is why if those things those people do why if it's that easy why don't you go and do it that is the question i'm asking myself that is the question and certain people say uh they will do that they are very they, they keep on criticizing and these people who criticize all the time are the same people who get into your inbox asking for help and it's the same thing. That is what is wondering me. <laughs> and sometimes I always need to laugh about this thing. It's so funny that somebody is seated there, sitting there, criticizing, oh, this lady is this, she's doing this, she's doing that. They will see all sorts of rubbish behind you. But at the end, when they need help, they are back to back on your inbox. But if you listen, you hear what they are talking about you. God. Then you ask yourself, so okay, I'm the one doing this thing. Then you're coming to take, get the money with which I'm going to do one or two things, one or two runs to get this money. So you want me to give you this money? But no. Hell no, I will never give you this money. So that's what it was really baffling me today. And the side of the man, that's the same thing. They will tell you, you did one or two funny things. In life, before you got, you you had no, they will never see the days that you were working hard to achieve success. They will never see that. They will only see when everything is shining, when everything is good, for them to come out and start having conclusions. So my dear brothers and sisters, if you are encountering such situations, it's not everybody you need to help in life. As a somebody, as somebody who succeeded in life, you need to be very strict. If you are not strict, you will go down. Because there are so many haters. Trust me. The haters are over. They are everywhere. You need to be very strict. If you are so soft, be you a man or a woman, then the success won't last for long. Because you'll be tempted to go to, to do everything each and everybody wants. But when you fall, nobody will be there for you. I'm sorry to tell you, but that's the truth. Success is for hard people. People who are determined. People who have that caliber, that charisma. That is why success is for them. Success is not for soft people. People who feel at every circumstance in life. I know it sounds hard, but that's the truth. You have to be very strict as a successful man. Trust me. You have to be very, 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 very strict as a successful man. Being strict is not being wicked. It's just taking care and having certain restrictions in your life. That's it. Some people will understand. People will say, like our people, they always tell you, he's so bossy, she's so bossy, this, this, this. No, that's not the point. And take note, when you succeed, some people will say she succeeded, she's no more keeping friends with the listing. 
when you succeed, the level changes. You are not the one who changes the level because people who who come close to you when you have succeeded are different. The standards are different. You can keep few friends in the past. That's true. That is true. But not everybody. Because there are certain people who come into your life to play a particular role. Not everybody you were in primary school with is your friend today. As life goes on, you make new friends. There are certain ladies that are married today. They don't, they don't even have contact with their classmates back in school. They have new friends completely from out of their life that they never even grew up with. That is life. So you shouldn't sit there be lamenting yourself concerning what people say because people will always talk. At the end, people will always have something to say. So if you want to live your life depending on what people will say, then you won't live that life. That was what I wanted to let you know. And to let you know that stay focused. Forget about people. What, what people will say. Because people will always talk. And bear me. If everybody sees something good in you. And nobody sees something bad. Then there is a problem somewhere. Because even Jesus Christ. I'm not trying to preach here. People saw something bad in Jesus. So who are you? That people won't see something bad in you. That's the point. Who are you that people won't see something bad in you? Think about that. That was a little one of today. That was baffling me. I always laugh about this stuff. Those people criticize you. They talk everything about you. But they are the same people in your inbox trying to beg, do these things like that. It's not directed to somebody. But it's just directed to daily life situations that happen. And that's the truth. It happens even to somebody in your daily life. He's, uh, they are talking bad about you, but they come close to you to ask for help. That's it. That's all it is. So in life, we need to be careful. We need to be optimistic, focused. That's the most important thing. You also buy Miams, your boy Miams, that the co-founder of the Miams Empire. Don't forget to share this video. And of course, give us your point of views on what you think. It was a long time having had, had videos before. So I decided to give you guys this once again. This one again. Thank you so much for your support. And I will always be grateful. Till then. Take care.